What's up guys, it's your boy Subarashi coming with another video for you all and I'll be talking about new Pokemon that are confirmed to be leaked in Scarlet and Violet. Images that you will see are not from the game, these are my designs but the, the concept of these Pokemon, the, the idea and the leak names of the Pokemon, well what they're going to be based on and also a couple of days ago we've also had a new Pokemon which was the uh, I, I Pokemon that was revealed by Pokemon themselves. So sit back and we'll get into the video everyone. So the first Pokemon we'll be talking about is the uh, Seagull Pokemon, yes there is going to be an alleged Seagull Pokemon in Scarlet and Violet. Uh, that I have created here, the concept it is confirmed to be a electric flying type seagull. So uh, there's going to be two evolutions for this Pokemon, and I don't know what type of um, seagull it's going to be based on. It's going to be just sand, uh, just some standard seagull. It's, it's just a waiting game uh, right now, just for more Pokemon. And uh, even the game will be here so soon. This is going to be in my team. This Pokemon, 100%. I can't wait to get this Pokemon on my team. If it's going to look like this when the game comes out, uh, I hope it does, but you know, like a little cute seagull Pokemon that we've had, you know, like Wingo, uh, that's really it. We haven't had any other like seagull Pokemon in the games besides Wingo, but yeah, this seagull Pokemon will be perfect for uh, Scarlet and Violet. So here's another Pokemon that I'll be showing you here, which is an evolution to the seagull Pokemon. So yes, as I said, it has, two ev has an evolution for it. So I based this design on an albatross, not technically a seagull, but an albatross would be kind of cool as well. May, uh, sticking with the uh, flying electric type, electric typing, uh, it's pretty interesting for another seagull to look like another seagull, because with Wingo it evolved into a, a pelican, is uh, named Pelipper. Yeah, we haven't seen anything like this before. Uh, Albatross maybe, as I said, but fingers crossed this this will actually look like in the game. I'm hoping it's going to look like this in the game. And then the final uh, bird, which <laughs> all of them have been birds lately. So we have, now we have the Parakeet Pokemon that is confirmed for the game. Now, and we don't know what it's going to look like, but we know it's typing is going to be a normal flying type. Well, Chatter is the same typing, is another uh, normal flying type. Uh, so another parrot's going to be that type, which is going to be based on a parakeet, not a parrot, a parakeet. Now, I basically based this design that I've created on the rose ring parakeet, which is very, uh, very a common bird in Asia, most parts of India and the Himalayas. Uh, also in the UK, it's very, a very a, a populated bird in the UK that is an invasive species. So maybe, even because it is a European bird now, so if we could see some in Spain as uh, Scarlet and Violet is based on that. And Scarlet and Violet has some parrots and parakeets native to uh, Spain. Well, some of them are uh, invasive, as I said. Hope it, when it comes out, I hope it looks like this. It's a pretty funny design I've designed here. And now we get to talk about the next Pokemon which was confirmed and shown a couple of days ago that was uh, in the trailer. So this new Pokemon is called Crafii and it is a eye eye. Uh, has hardly has any pupils, it's really big. It look, really looks like um, a Stitch from Leo and Stitch. It's a really like real Gremlin Pokemon. It uses its, um, like, its uh, middle finger to paint on like branches and uses its paint to attract Pokemon to eat, which is quite dark in, to say the least, in Pokemon that to actually be official like information on this Pokemon, which is incredible. I like I like the fact that everyone thought that it was gonna be having like paint on its tail and using its tail instead of its hands. Every design I that everyone tried to speculate what it could be and look like, everyone had paint on its tail. In fact, it doesn't even use its tail. It doesn't even have any paint on its tail in the official art. But incredible art from all the people that uh, tried to speculate on this Pokemon, what it was going to look like. Amazing job to all those guys. I've seen all those arts on, on Twitter when, when the first trailer was coming out. We didn't even know what it could have looked like. The silhouette was showing. Brilliant, brilliant artwork from those people. So, new YI Pokemon. Uh, poison normal type is an indeed a very a, in first Pokemon to be a, a poison normal type kind of suits it It's basically a graffiti artist really <laughs> a graffiti artist I.I. Pokemon 
Now that's cool, and I like I like to have this on my team when when Scarlet and Violet come out. So yeah, that is three new Pokemon that I've designed that are going to be uh, speculating for the leak. You know that are leaked. Uh, also, the confirmed Pokemon that came out a couple of days ago, uh, Graf uh, Grafii, which is an incredible Pokemon. I absolutely love it. And that is it, everyone. Thank you for watching and listening. Also, um, if you want to check some of my art before I post them on the video, check my Twitter, because that's where my art hangs around. And also, subscribe to me, and I hope you all have a good day.